I don't know what that is. Probably pronounce that wrong. <laughs> we literally oh, told you we were. This is like the 13th take of our Japan haul video. And it's super noisy right now because we are recording this in India. So, yeah. I'm gonna start with these strawberry Kit Kats. And on the back, there's like a thing for folding the Kit Kat wrapper into a, a paper crane. Um, and we're gonna open these. The next one is apple Kit Kats. Uh, Shinshu apples. And we're not opening this one because it's a gift. Actually, I don't even know. I don't want to really try this. Okay, let's try it. Oh, it's already melted. Where's the coldest place in the trail? Can you give me the apple one? Whoa. It actually tastes like a strawberry. Like, it tastes sour like a real... Sweet. Yeah, it's like... No, like sweet, then sour, then sweet again. Sour. It tastes just like a strawberry. Mm. It's cool. Apple, please. No. I still like like normal Kit Kats better. Where's the coldest place in this room? Okay, and then we got these hard candies to take back to the US because these won't melt. There's apple, lemon, peach, and grape. Okay, so that's all the food we got. And then we got a lot of cooking utensils, I guess you could say. We got a sushi mat. Should I open this? Sushi mat. So that we can make sushi at home. Whoa. That's cute. And it smells nice. And oh, all these things we got from... Uh, actually, no, not all of them, but most of the things we got from Daiso, which is a 100 yen store. So everything there is like around a dollar. Like a dollar store. And then, this isn't mine, it's my little sister's, but she got a My Neighbor Totoro Bento box. This was not from Daiso, this was from Don Quixote, which it was, it's like a seven story store that's like targeted mainly towards tourists. And so this was, this was more than a dollar. I don't know how much it was, how much was it, do you know? I also wanted one, but like, what am I going to do with a bento box when I don't even pack that much in college? Wow, it is really loud. There's like some construction going on. And then I got these chopsticks at Daiso. And I got, and then I ended up getting a different pair of chopsticks at Don Quixote. These really cute green chopsticks that go in a, a little Totoro box and I think these are like children's chopsticks which is why they're like so tiny so I don't know if they're gonna be too too small for my hands so let's see they have their own little case that's so cute does say my neighbor Totoro on each of the chopsticks. That's really cute. It's okay though, I'll make it work. And then they go in this little case. See, they go in the case. And then you just, oh. That's the cutest thing ever. Okay, we had an interruption for a moment, but we are back on track. So the next thing is this, which is a chopstick holder, the last chopstick holder, and it's about Fuji, which we didn't even see, but we did. I think I got a glimpse of it as we were leaving the airport. So it goes like, like this on the table, and then you just place your chopsticks on it. So like the food bit doesn't get dirty. Which is actually really like something you don't realize you need until you're like eating and then you need to put your chopsticks down and you can't like balance it anywhere. And it's glass, so I'm gonna put it back in the packaging. Okay, the next thing we're gonna do is 
all the stickers that we got. Stickers. Yeah, it's just like stationary. And all of these are from Daiso. So some of these are for friends and some of these are my sisters. And none of them are mine. Um, because I just wasn't into stickers. I'm not really sure why this one has a popsicle stick oh, in it. It's a, like, you have to transfer. It's a transfer. Oh, it's a transfer sticker. So you cut out the illustration, and then there's a transparent sheet, and then you put it in place, and you rub it on to transfer it. Kind of like a tattoo, but sticker version. That's interesting. Um, Sanrio was really big in Japan. Obviously, I'm pretty sure it's Japanese. So, yep, stickers. And then the next thing we're going to do is tape, washi tape. So, my sister got these for scrapbooking. And these are all from Daiso. So, will you give me the one that's mine in there? This one is like a fancy one. This is like a... Like, it's like a mystery washi tape package. So like, you'll get one of these in here. So. so this one is like a little green tea and a sushi. And I actually got this for free for doing like a tourism survey at the airport. And then we got a bunch of these kneaded erasers um, in like different scents. Uh, open one because there's one that's mine as well comes in a cute little plastic package there we go wow definitely smells like oranges Ooh, and it's squishy like play-doh I wonder one sec, son. You can put it into like a little point for erasing. I don't know how well it erases though. It makes my hands smell like an orange as well. That's fun. My sister got like a notebook. It's, it's an eraser. It's literally just a notebook. Really? And then I got some stationery for mailing letters. I really like the seals. They had a lot of like wax and stamp sets and I wanted to get one, but I couldn't really find one where it was like in English or like something I could read. And yeah, I, I didn't look very carefully anyway. So um, cute cat sticky note. And I got uh, this thing where like you open this little plastic thing and then there's cat sticky notes in it too. These double-sided markers, these are for our cousins, and then um, my sister got a pen, and I got a brush pen. I believe it's dual-sided, so a brush pen. And then miscellaneous items that we got. Uh, my sister got this. It's a Shiba Inu. It's like squishy. It's cute. Uh, cinnamon roll? Cinnamon roll. Cinnamon roll. Oh yeah, it's, it's not cinnamon roll. Cinnamon roll pouch. So it's on you. Um, this thing that looks like white out, but it's actually glue tape. So you like roll it like white out and then you stick something on, like, like a glue stick kind of. And then I got these really pretty beads for my friend who likes making jewelry. And I got a lot of like really s small things so that I can like mail the gifts to my friend it's because I'm not going home at all over winter break and so like I won't see them so I have to get it to them somehow. And yeah, that's everything we got in Japan, which it doesn't seem like that much, but considering we were only there for a day, I think it's a lot. All right, 